हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू ई कंटेंट सेक्शन ऑफ ऑल इंडिया शिवाजी मेमोरियल सोसाइटीज इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी पुणे आई एम विक्रम देशमुख असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर ऐट इंजीनियरिंग सायसेस डिपार्टमेंट ऑल इंडिया श्री शिवाजी मेमोरियल सोसायटीज इंस्टिट्यूट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी सो टूडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज introduction to environmental studies so what we we learn today what are the different objective or key takeaways of today's lecture discuss the scope of environment describe various types of environment describe importance of environmental studies so first question is what is environment so Uh, if you uh, want to de define environment it is a complex set of physical geographical biological social cultural and political condition that surrounds an individual or organism and that ultimately determine its form and nature of its survival so it is a physical geographical social cultural and political condition that surrounds an individual which ultimately determine form and nature of survival of human being uh, of living things the word environment is actually derived from the french verb environ which means surrounding so in simple language we can define environment anything that surround us is environment thus our environment can be physical chemical and biological world that surrounds us now what is environmental science environmental science is a multidisciplinary branch of science that investigate question related to human population resources damages and disturbances caused due to this population now what do we learn in environmental science as we know environmental science is the branch of science which investigate question related to human population resources and damages disturbance caused by the population so we learn in environment how environment affect us how we affects environment how nature works and how to live more sustainably okay in figure you can see interaction between earth life support system and human cultural sphere you can see interaction of earth life support system and human cultural sphere in uh, uh, in the image shown now what are the different components of environment so there are two components of environment biotic components abiotic components all living things comes under the biotic component and all living things comes under the abiotic components so example of biotic component are people children trees grass plant insect bird etc and example of abiotic components are playground benches sing slide air water mountain it is in simple way so environment is a place around us which include people children benches grass ground trees insect bird sunlight air land water mountain in short it may include it includes biotic and abiotic components so Uh, as we know biotic component that means all living things interact and exchange thing with each other and also with a biotic component for their survival and existence now next point is types of environment so if you consider there are main four types of environment natural environment man made environment social environment and psychological environment so what is natural environment the environment 
in its original form without the interference of human being is known as natural environment all living and non living things occurring naturally on earth is the example of natural environment man made environment the environment changed or modified by interference of human being is called as man made environment examples are infrastructure utilities institutes housing industries parks building energy networks transportation etc now social environment social environment includes individuals social economical political condition where he lives examples of social environments are customs traditions ethics language culture profession living condition etc now what is psychological environment every individual has its own psychological environment in which he lives the psychological environment enable us to understand personality of an individual both the person and his goal for psychological environment now structure of environment so structure of environment include physical environment and biological environment so uh, what is physical environment physical environment include solid liquid and gases solid the lithosphere lithosphere soil land and mountains in liquid environment it may contain hydrosphere river reservoir oceans and glacier environment in gas uh, you know gas physical environment contains various gases like oxygen carbon dioxide nitrogen methane etc present in atmosphere so what is biological environment the all living thing uh, plants trees grass herb animals domestic wild animals human being insect that means all flora and fauna comes under the biological environment now what is the scope of environmental study the sub this subject educates student subject expert citizen to understand the complex nature of environmental issues second the expert having knowledge in the environmental field can enable can enable them to facilitate solution to various complex environmental problems the current trend of environmental degra degradation can be reversed if if the people from educated societies and communities are organized and empowered by knowing this subject we we people student and subject expert can develop eco friendly new technologies for various development which further can save natural resources and also reduces environmental pollution its impact on human health next as the new earth is not discovered till now we have to we have the, the we don't have any uh, option except to maintain ecological balance on planet earth so that livable environment can be kept for future generation to live sustainably to live sustainably the major areas where role of scientist environmental scientist are plays vital role are natural resources ecosystems biodiversity and its conservation environmental pollution social issues human pollution and environment what is the need and importance of environmental study so it uh, uh, we need public awareness environmental issues being in international importance problems cropped in wake of development so environmental issues are cropped due to the development we need to conserve energy we should uh, look for alternative solution we should save species from extinction we should save natural resources for future generation to live uh, more sustainably we should reduce pollution we have to uh, use uh, wise plan planning 
फॉर डेवलपमेंट वी शूड मेन्टेन सस्टेनेबल डेवलपमेंट सो दीज आर द इम्पॉर्टन्स एंड स्कोप ऑफ एनवायरमेंटल स्टडीज सो वी हैव टू स्टडी एनवायरमेंटल स्टडीज नाउ समरीज ऑफ टूडेज लेक्चर वॉट वी हैव सीन इन टूडेज लेक्चर वॉट वी हैव लर्न इन टूडे वी हैव लर्न एनवायरमेंट इट्स डेफिनेशन एंड स्कोप टाइप्स ऑफ एनवायरमेंट स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एनवायरमेंट नीड एंड इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ एनवायरमेंट सो दीज आर सम रेफरसेस फॉर फर्दर स्टडी और फर्दर रीडिंग थैंक यू ऑल हैव अ नाइस डे हैप्पी लर्निंग लेट अस्टॉप हियर बट लेट्स लर्निंग कंटिन्यू